Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. The truth remains that HH Moscow he must step down. This is not because we don't love him. This is for the sake of millions of Zambians, especially the poor. He must step down. We must tell ourselves the truth that the person we thought we are campaigning for is not the person that took over power. We gave power to somebody that is antisocial. He doesn't like people, especially the poor, the uneducated, and the blacks. The president is more free and comfortable around the whites than the blacks. The president feels safe around the rich, the educated than the poor and the people on the street. During campaign, I remember several times that I forced him. I feel pity for people that uh, think that I don't speak to the president. Or people that think that I don't communicate to the president. The time of evidence is coming and I will show you everything. I remember during campaign, I was the one that was pushing him to go out. Go to the field and fight from the field. Go to the street and meet people on the street. I see a one was doing it. And the president told me to say, look, I, when I go to the street, they will arrest me. I told him, go there. Let them arrest you. The more they arrest you, the more we are getting vote of sympathy. When he go to the street, he sees the result and he come back to me and say, look, people are happy because I was on the street. We forced him to be a social person. Personally, myself, I see one. I forced him to be a social person, pushing him to go in the compounds, go and meet people. I know that he, the president is a person that is not free among the blacks or among the poor. But we needed it because we are campaigning. We needed it, and that was forcing him to do that. HH is not loved by the people. Let us be clear with this. President HH is not people's favorite. We made him people's favorite. We painted Edigalungu black. We made sure that Edigalungu becomes a demon that people, while voting, we are thinking that if they voted Edigalungu in, by now Zambia would have been gone. We put those fears on people. And there was no option than to vote in HH. HH is not loved by the people. If he was loved, I mean, that guy is, was the longest serving opposition. How many times did he contest and lost? We came in and branded him and made him a social person by force. He doesn't have the heart for the poor people. There are people that is free with the, 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 comfort, the rich guys. That is why, as a president voted into power, he has never visited his uh, party headquarters. He doesn't care what people are going through on the street. He doesn't care about anyone. What he cares is his white friends, his educated friends, and his rich friends. If you check, go to the catalog and see the people that are winning contracts in Zambia. They are connected to President HH. It's either their friends or business partners. Even in the mind, that's exactly what is happening. Nothing for the poor. If you are just coming from the street and think that you win a contract in this government, you are joking. You must be educated, friend of the president, and the rich. If not, there is nothing for you. The poor people do not have any hope in this government. That's why I'm saying for the sake of peace, for the sake of 
uh, for the sake of the people of Zambia that we convinced to vote for him he must go it's either he bring out someone from UPND that will stand in 2026 or he lets UPND go just like that because I can assure you that UPND will never win presidency in 2026 we can be playing you you can call me all sorts of name you can say what you want to say but i don't have time for those things i've proved myself enough i just did a voice note here in this group this is a group with few people but it's all over i mean millions of people are talking about it i've received uh, hundreds of messages from european leaders this is just on whatsapp on a group what happened when i go to the page and start telling people what i know about her church what i know about upn you're going to mess up the, the party will die it will die flat out completely this is happening because of greediness the government is awarding contract to the friends of the president who do not care about the party the president has appointed ministers who do not care about the party they just want to be rich and rich alone the party is dying while ministers are becoming wealthy the party is dying while the president is becoming wealthy. the 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 government cannot even employ a good photographer check the pictures they are posting on the on the page of the president it's like pictures that was taken in 1991 19, 1990 go to ps pages and see what picture is all about chelatu kuta was doing a very good job publishing good pictures and taking good pictures of the president and he was he was fired and thrown away to brazil it's just that he's an idiot also he's, he's a useless press singer that anything you throw at him like a dog he can eat if not the guy was doing a very good job at state house but because according to them they cannot afford it check the pictures they are posting on the page of a uh, church i sit in president and check the picture that pf are flooding the internet with check the quality you can see that these guys are greedy to the core they are greedy that they cannot even sponsor their own government they cannot sponsor their own party they steal millions they loot millions they loot billions i don't even want to go far if i start talking now i mean the guy will not have peace it won't have you won't have peace things will be messed up i just made the voice note everywhere is is stumbling people are waking up to talk what happened when i start going live and start pointing out who hh is who upnd is what they are doing at state house we want him out in peace he must go for peace to reign Alright, that's all for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.